Hey guys, how's it going? Um, just your day three, day three feedback video, as well as just to kind of give you a quick preview of what's going to be going on tomorrow. Um, today, overall, um, you know, I was went through and read the responses to the one question quiz, and those of you turned in that, as well as the critical response question. A um, couple things, just uh, overall, um, some of the things that I really liked uh, seeing was your examples. You guys use really great examples as far as modern day. Um, issues of federalism between state, federal governments, and individual citizens. Some of you guys use examples like healthcare, um, you know, federal mandates that surrounded that. Um, of course, many of you use the uh, protesters' examples and kind of that battle between um, state, federal, law enforcement. Of course, with the president uh, mentioning a couple of times of, of military action, things like that, and of course, um, you know, states' governors obviously responding with. Um, you know some some of their own interpretations of how how they can handle um, what's going on across the country. Um, so really enjoyed seeing those. Um, continue to respond also to that if you if you get a chance, please respond to that midweek uh, just feedback survey just to get your guys take on things and and uh, hear from you and whatnot. Um, there are a few of you in class right now who I haven't heard from at all. I'll be making some calls uh, tomorrow um, to you. A couple of you guys are my football guys, so I uh, already have your cell phone number, so to be expecting a phone call from your football coach tomorrow. Um, also, um, with the uh, critical response question, one of the things that I did notice is that uh, for issues in which I did take off some points, uh, what I was seeing was um, just maybe not necessarily following some of those things that you guys learned in English a few years ago and, and kind of throughout your English courses, which is those standalone paragraphs, topic sentences, support, elaborating on those things. Um, you know, some of you, you know, and, and I actually have this problem myself in my own writing. Sometimes I'll have a statement and I don't necessarily support that statement with evidence. Um, so uh, that's certainly something that, that not just you, but I, I, I got to work on. Um, for my grad classes and whatnot. So, uh, but overall, I uh, was really, you know, really pleased with what I saw so far. Uh, of course, um, you know, slide 21 is where you needed to go for the critical response question. I had forgotten to, to mention that in the directions. Uh, so when you're um, looking for that, if you haven't done that yet, that's where that, that um, question is. So make sure you do that. Um, also, what's on tap for tomorrow? So tomorrow will be an extension activity. We'll be given a choice between uh, two uh, Supreme Court cases. One will be from 1896, which will be Plessy versus Ferguson, which, um, of course, focused um, 14th Amendment, you know, issues like that uh, surrounded Plessy Ferguson, as well as um, I think it's Chouette versus um, Affirmative Action, Coalition to Defend Affirmative Action uh, from 2000, 2000s. So a recent case, maybe even like maybe from six years ago, I think maybe 2014. So um, I'll be posting both of those activities. You only have to do one though, okay? So you will pick. You can either pick the affirmative action case that's more recent, or you can go with something that you probably heard in a U.S. history class, like a Plessy Ferguson, something like that. So you can pick from one of those two. Um, I will also accompany with those. I will also post like an audio file of me just reading um, the like case briefing and things like that. Uh, that. Um, you know, accompany the assignment. Um, and then I'll ex also give you an explanation that's in the uh, graphic organizer that you have to do, which is like a brief historical investigation of looking at some uh, modern day issue um, as it relates uh, maybe to the issues presented to you in that case. Uh, so you will have that um, for me for tomorrow. Um, also, you know, those of you uh, just kind of double checking real fast. So I'm doing pretty well on time. It looks like uh, just since the last time I graded, uh, three of you turned it in. One person resubmitted, which is great. I like seeing that. So if I give you feedback on something, just to reiterate that, and you make the corrections on the feedback that I give you, you can recoup all of the points uh, for that particular assignment, and I will regrade that. Um, so uh, hopefully that, that is something that those of you um, who may not get the desired score that you were looking for, um, you got that opportunity to make that, that correction. Okay, And of course, always uh, you can, you know, shoot me a message, um, either text. Obviously, you can uh, communicate through me through Google Classroom. Uh, so that way you're not, um, you know, twisted in the wind if you have any questions or you're confused about something. I know I, I sometimes don't give uh, or am thorough enough in my direction. So I, I totally understand that. Uh, but uh, day three uh, is in the books for you. Uh, I'll continue to be grading these things. I'm not going to be doing any more grading tonight. But um, I will be doing that in the morning as well as getting some of those assignments posted. Um, you can probably look for those assignments to be posted um, somewhere uh, between 8 and 9 o'clock tomorrow morning. 
so uh, hope everybody's having, you know, staying safe. And, um, you know, if you're watching this video and uh, you, you're paying attention, I did change hats. Um, you know, nobody just seemed to either they didn't care or they didn't make it to the end of the video yesterday. Uh, because if you make it to the end of the video and you care at all, um, I've got uh, every major league hat. So you can pick the team. So you pick the team, just post it in Google Classroom in the comments uh, or put a post up there, say, hey, Stein, wear this hat. Uh, if it's your team, whatever, I don't care. I've got every single one. Uh, so um, go ahead and uh, you know, leave, a, leave a post in Google Classroom if you wanna see your team's hat um, on, on your teacher. So today we went uh, from the other, from one coast to the other. We went from the West Coast to the East Coast. Yesterday was LA, today's the Yankees. Um, so yeah. I hope everybody's doing well and uh, yeah, hope to see everybody soon.